Well, hello friends, I'm here right now with Steven from Cirque Mechanics. How are you, Steven? Doing very fine, thank you. Excellent. Wow, so you've got people climbing all up and down this massive contraption of yours. Yep. Let me introduce you to the gantry, the gantry <laughs> bike. What, do, what are we looking at here? What is it exactly that you do? Well, we do a roving mobile circus. That is to say, this rig here is on wheels. We pedal over the audience, we pedal down the street, we locate ourselves and, and make a basically a portable show with aerialists juggling, Chinese pole, hand balancing, hula hooping, all sorts of wonderful contemporary circus acts. Excellent. Now, how did you first get involved with this? How did I first get involved with this? Well, the yeah. gentleman that created this thing, who runs Cirque Mechanics, his name is Chris Lashua, and he and I met in Cirque du Soleil many, many years ago. We did a, a several shows together. And this is his brainchild. And he brought me on to do uh, some of the acts and to kind of do crowd control when we move through the audience. Okay, and so tell me about some of the individual things that you do here. You said you do, um, you've got acrobatics. Mm -hmm. What else? Well, we have uh, uh, aerial hoop, which is currently uh, rig rigged up there still. Um, a lovely young lady, Hannah, does an act in that, and that goes up and down. Uh, we have a hand balancer that works up on this table up here. Her canes are, are currently preset for the next show. Okay. Uh, hula hoop act, a wonderful uh, young lady from Chicago is performing with us currently. Uh, I do a juggling act okay. on the ground where it's safe. <laughs> <laughs> what's, the, what's the most dangerous thing that you've ever juggled? The most dangerous thing I've ever juggled? Um, well, you know, there's fire, there are knives, there are chainsaws, and, and all that sort of pedestrian, but uh, uh, dangerous... <laughs> Yeah, I don't really know. I mean, <laughs> to I, you, it's not dangerous. Yeah, yeah, exactly. By the time I'm, <laughs> I'm doing it, uh, I, I, I hopefully am in control. Right. Um, you know, I try to stay fairly safe. I've been doing this a long time. And How many years have you been juggling? Uh, about 35 now. 35 years. What's the maximum amount of balls you can get in the air at once? I, I do five in my act currently. Okay. The, the lar large, large set balls. Uh, I've done seven, eight, nine when I was much younger. But, uh, uh, nowadays, it's not about how many. It's about what you do. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> That's true. That sounded great, didn't it? Yeah, I thought so too. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. Well, we are so appreciative that you're here as part of our 2014 Virginia Arts Festival. Well, thank you for having us. We're very glad to be here. We've been treated wonderfully by the Arts Council, and the weather's been divine. The site here that we're working in is just perfect. We're having a great time. Excellent. And we're here right now at the Sandler Center, but you're going to be in Norfolk, and you're going to be in another location. Yep. Right? We, we travel around with the gantry. In fact, we have two of these rigs. The other one is currently in Las Vegas, and uh, we swap back and forth, east coast, west coast, and travel all wow. over with this. So we'll be touring uh, all through the summer, doing fairs, festivals, and so on. Very cool. Very cool. Well, thank you so much for speaking with me, and I look forward to catching your act tonight. Thank you. We'll be here. 1015. All right, so I'm here with some more Cirque Mechanics performers. How are you? Great. Thanks. Pretty good. Excellent. So why don't you tell me, starting over here, tell me your name and, and where you're from. Uh, my name's Sam, and I'm from Minnesota. All right. I'm Clint. I'm from Indiana. And I'm Hannah from Indiana. <laughs> I'm Charlotte. I'm from San Diego, California. All right, so you guys are kind of from all over, and now you're here in Virginia at our Virginia Arts Festival 2014. We're so fortunate to have you. So tell me a little bit about the show. I mean, what do you do here? What's it like? You know, what's your show like? Well, it's really mobile. You can see that. Uh, the whole thing moves. We can be stationary for the entire show. We can row. Uh, some of the performance spaces we're in actually go down the street. We travel in different spots. Um, and we're all over this thing the whole time. We're climbing all over. And pretty cool. This show is really unique in that it's a completely autonomous rig. It's a rig that doesn't need to be attached to anything. So we can do the entire show anywhere, moving down the street. And it's really one of the very few shows in the world where that's possible. Well, wow. so this is like uh, circus acrobatics. Is that how you would describe it? Yeah. 
Yeah, it's a, the, whole, the whole idea behind the company is to mix mechanical motion with acrobatics. So we take traditional circus equipment and then we tie it in with this mechanical motion. It's all human powered. And it kind of it amps everything up, makes it a little more original and creative. And so you guys are like probably hanging upside down and doing all kinds of crazy things up there. What's going through your mind when you're doing these death-defying stunts with no net? Where, yeah, go ahead. I usually think about food. Food? <laughs> You think about food? Yeah. My next meal. <laughs> something, something soft? Uh, yeah, right, yeah. Um, we're, we're very well trained. We've had a lot of practice in what we're doing. And really, when you're actually doing the trick, you are much less aware of what's around you than you might think. So when I'm not doing the trick, I see the audience and I see where I am. But when I'm doing the trick, I'm really just in the trick. And okay. that where I am doesn't matter so much. You're, you're in the moment, so to speak. Yeah. yeah. Very cool. All right, well, guys, I'm really looking forward to seeing your show tonight. Is it is it scarier doing it at night when it's darker, or is it pretty much the same? No, no, it's more exciting. We like doing it. We're used to doing it in closed spaces as well, where there's very little lighting and it's dark. It makes it a little more dramatic. So you're going to light it up. Oh, yeah? The shadows are better. It just looks really cool at night. You guys are action heroes in my book. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, thank you so much for coming to the Virginia Arts Festival and performing for us. We really appreciate it. Thanks for having us. Thanks for speaking with me tonight. Yep. Bye.